thank you guys so much. Um, uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So today is my 500 subscriber special, I think that's how you say it. I'm new to all of this, so I'm learning as I go. <laughs> um, so I just want to say um, I'm just so overwhelmed with, with my YouTube thing kicking off and um, how many people have watched my original testimony and I just pray that the Lord is using um, my testimony to bring his children home. I'm praying, <laughs> praying, praying, praying every day um, that that is a useful thing. That what I'm doing is useful for the kingdom and um, every day I'm praying also that um, I'll stop if I, if I should stop, Lord. I don't want to be doing stuff that's not his will as well so there's a lot of that so <laughs> every day I'm just submitting to the Lord and saying use me I'll continue if you want me to continue I won't if you if you don't want me to um we'll just see how it goes type thing so every day as it comes I'm just submitting to the Lord and um yeah so today for the 500 um, subscriber special I have a really amazing story to tell you guys um, I haven't said on the internet yet um, and this was about a month maybe a little bit under a month ago basically oh I'm getting arm ache I need to get myself a little thing for this for my phone eh? Um, so it was amazing um, I was praying and praying and praying Lord 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 please what do you want me to do for the kingdom um, Use me as your vessel, just give me a clear word on what what I can do, what should I be doing that is your will, Lord. Um, obviously I know reading the Bible, praying, but practical stuff. I was kind of asking like, is it right that I should be doing the YouTube, basically? Is it right that I should be um, spending time doing online content and reaching people that way? Is this right, Lord? Is this right for me to be doing for you? not right for me, it doesn't matter what's right for me, it's what's right for the Lord. And so, I was praying this, and I just did that simple prayer the night before um, before I went to sleep, just asking the Lord, what should I be doing? And um, I woke up to the audible voice of our Father. <laughs> Amazing, I mean, I've never heard it since, I don't know if I will, but that time I did. And it was amazing. So, um, basically, um, it was like a whole roll of thunder and it was just so powerful, so powerful. And it was like, I had a, a vision of a mobile phone and switching it on so that it received its signal. So I had a, a vision of going and using a phone and switching the signal on, which is quite symbolic. Um, but the whole way through my whole sleep, there was one word that was just like, it was like all the way through my sleep, all night it said that one word, that one time, just like so, so powerful, like jet engines and thunder and just whoo, the might of our Lord. Woo! It was a... Uh, incredible and as I woke up it was like Woof, wow okay it was a very clear word and it was a very clear command and what our father said is testify testify it's important guys it's really important so for today's video I just wanted to encourage you guys that if you've got a story where the Lord has worked in your life um, get it out there Get it on YouTube, it doesn't matter about if you feel shy or... I just pray that the Lord gives you courage and strength and, and you do it because the Lord wants us to. The Lord wants us to testify. Um, and I've got this little verse here which is powerful, which is Revelations 12, 11. And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. It's there, it's in the Bible. And we overcame the enemy by the blood of the Lamb and by our testimony. It's so important to get it out there, guys. And um, I just pray that you get encouragement and and the Lord really just gives you all the 
courage to to do it because um you know it can really really help others with planting seeds for others that they come to the lord and um you know we're called to do that um you know in mark 16:15 it says go into the world and preach the gospel to every creature you know he's saying for us to go into the world because we're not of the world anymore and preach the gospel to every creature and um, I think YouTube's a great tool um, to get your your testimony out there on on the YouTube. Out to so many people. I mean, it's amazing. I never would have thought so many people watched mine. And it's just what a blessing to be used by the Lord to bring His children home. It's just a wonderful thing, wonderful thing. And so I'm just going to leave you with um, Matthew 5:14 to 16. You are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hidden, nor do they light a lamp and put it under a basket, but on a lampstand, and it gives light to all who are in the house. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Guys, you've been given the Holy Spirit. You know, you know the Lord. Stop hiding under a basket and get that light out there. Put it up on a stand like he says and declare your love for the Lord because he's coming back. He's coming back. And um, yeah, hearing his voice saying testify, whew, he is powerful. And um, there was, ooh, there was, it was a command. It was a command, guys. And um, yeah, so I just wanted to leave that with you for the 500 subscriber special, I think that's what we call it, um, because that's epic, the audible voice of our father. I mean, I've been saving that one. <laughs> that's a really special one. And like I said, I'm not sure if that'll ever happen again, though I'm praying for it to happen every single day, <laughs> of course. Um, but yeah, so guys, share, 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 share your stories, get your testimony out there. Share the light. I love you guys. God bless.